This morning, a South African teen is reuniting with her birth family nearly 18 years after her kidnapping. She was taken from a hospital just days after birth. It turns out she was raised only miles from her real family's home in Cape Town. The girl is now in a safe place and not talking. But Deborah Potter was able to track down her birth parents. Deborah, good morning. Good morning. This is the neighborhood that the kidnapped girl grew up in. It's just a few miles from the home of her biological parents who had been searching for her for nearly 18 years. Celeste and Mornay nurse knew their baby girl for just three days before she was snatched from her hospital cot. It's heartbreaking. As a mom, you can't stop thinking about her. Is she okay? Is she not being abused? Is she loved? Is she in a warm house? The nurses had three more children, but there was always a hole in their hearts. Every year, they celebrated the birthday of their missing daughter. Then, 17 years on, their second daughter, Cassidy, began high school and made a remarkable discovery. Cassidy came home and she told me, Daddy, there's a girl at school that resembles me completely. So I made it my duty to meet this girl. He even managed to take a few photographs and the resemblance was uncanny. The police were brought in and a nail-biting six-week wait began, during which DNA tests were taken. Then a detective phoned. I was so scared to answer the phone. I said, hello? Yes? I said, Celeste, you are mother again. I said, no. And at first I said, no, I couldn't talk. I couldn't talk at all. My friend had to take the phone. I couldn't talk now. You are so, so much joy. Zephanie had been living just a few miles away. I burst out into tears when I saw her. And she, she kept me like this in her arms. The first time when she saw her dad, and he was standing, she was standing in front, and he was standing at the back. And I, I couldn't know, I, didn't, I couldn't explain the feeling, what I was feeling. And when she came to me, I just, I couldn't stop crying. I couldn't stop crying. I said, finally, I found you. For 17 years, I've been looking for you. I found you finally, you mind again. It's gonna make me cry. <laughs> Look, the bond was there. So when I saw her, I, I, I explained to her the feeling that you had. It explains it all. And um, The family who cared for her for 17 years and the parents she's just met have to face each other in court. But the mother who longed for her for 17 years says she won't keep her from the family who raised her. When I see the woman that took her, I would like to give her a hug. When I see her, I say, thank you for what you've done. You've done a good job. Look at my daughter. She's beautiful inside out. The woman accused of kidnapping Zephanie and who raised her as her own for over 17 years has been arrested. And the young girl has been taken to a place of safety as she slowly gets to know her birth family. That was such an amazing... Thank you, Deborah. That was such an amazing story. And the fact that she said she wants to thank the woman that took her. Powerful what story, grace. though. What a powerful what story of a mother's oh, parents' boy. love.